Everyone, see me and I you today. Hi, hello. Hi everyone, see you in the video today, and today we are using my nail clipper to open a box. What's inside of the box? You know by now because you saw the thumbnail and the title. Huion uh, Canvas 22 Plus and all that paper. Okay, uh, it's a box inside of a box. That's lovely. We love that. So today I'm gonna give you, bring you a review slash first impression slash. Uh, I don't know, uh, of this amazing new tablet that I've been trying for about a month. Um, they sent me this in, in addition to the uh, giveaway that was running on my Instagram for the month of December. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, Julian, thank you. Um, and I'm gonna be telling you what I've been feeling about it, what I miss, what I don't miss, what I think it's good, what I don't think it's that good. And yeah, gonna be giving you an honest review of this. Uh, sure. <laughs> okay, so as you can see here, this is way bigger than the one I currently own. Uh, I currently owned a Canvas 13. Wow. And uh, this one is at 22. So 13 inches to 22 inches. Not gonna say like sizes matter, but to me, Jesus Christ, it changed my workflow. Honestly, it did. So here, um, this specific model comes with a USB-C to USB-C cable. So you can in like connect it with your phone and draw on your phone using the tablet. Or like watch a movie. I've watched a movie on it from my phone. It's awesome. You can see me here saying goodbye to the old Canvas 13 and comparing it by size i share that picture on my story but yeah this uh huyan canvas 22 plus has 140 percent srgb color gamut a hatch anti-glare glass that we are gonna see here like i'm gonna be recording it from the top view and it legit it doesn't really glare much um it is fully laminated so the tip will look like it's touching where it's supposed to be touching and uh, right now i'm going to be testing out the pen pressure i was on the phone and i was going crazy about it because from my canvas 13 to this one the difference i can't even like tell you about it so uh, i'm sorry for that that was my whatsapp whoops uh so here i chose to showcase the end of 2020 piece because i used a lot of different uh functions basically of this outlet i used a lot of pen pressure i used a lot of just like full strokes with this piece and it handled it like a dream so i've been doing this magic uh i don't know what to to, tell, to call it like it's a magic effect i've been um adding it to a lot of my work recently and people have been asking me how i do it and when i tell them oh it's not like a png or anything i just drew it on people can't really believe that but the thing is when i had my canvas 13 i couldn't do that but now with this one like it just feels like i'm drawing on paper so it's i don't know it just feels natural uh, that's a thing I've been like really really loving having like the truest color I have ever experienced I don't really remember the previous uh, tablet I was using uh, to be like this true to color uh, honestly on my canvas 13 maybe because I didn't really adjust it like I should have uh, my saturation was so high that all my works in comparison to the works I've been creating with this one uh, looked a lot duller, duller, dull, duller, I don't know how to say that, unsaturated because I tended to like raise the saturation and oh it's too saturated let me lower it down and when I posted it it would be like so unsaturated because well my tablet was extremely saturated so yeah th this tablet has fixed that i've been using the default settings i tested the worms the warmth settings and the cooler settings for the screen i d didn't really enjoy any of the other options um i will not be setting it up on my own that's out of the question the pen pressure i tested a few different curves to it um 
I think the default one works fine for what I do with it. I will be testing it more throughly, uh, through it, through it, through, I don't know what to speak. I don't know what to speak. Uh, I'm gonna be doing more tests, but for what I do, I think the default settings are great. Uh, the thing I've been missing a lot, and this is where uh, I, I, I think, like, I think these tablets are very good, but buttons. Oh my god, I was so used to having like my buttons on my tablet. Like I had my uh, big or small, like for the brush, I had a uh, apply image already set up so I could just like click that button and I would like apply image for my time lapse things. Oh, and that has been messing up my flow. I've been like good with uh, setting some hotkeys on my keyboard. I don't really enjoy having to use my keyboard, but it's not like that bad of a thing. But the apply image buttons, oh, that messed me up. <laughs> but yeah, um, I don't think it's worth the, um, the difference. So if you don't really care about buttons, like honestly, go for this. Like, and if you, even if you care about buttons, your keyboard works just right. I miss it because I was so used to it, but I think I'm going to just get used to not having it uh, really fast. Um, here you can see me like paint color in and the way I just like, it's just easy. It just, it just looks right. The pressure is right. The way it flows in my hand is right. Uh, I don't know. Like I, I honestly can't explain the difference in the feeling, but the other one I didn't feel like where I was putting my pen was the right place when I thought like, let's say I put it on a specific point, it wouldn't really go there. So sometimes that would happen. And I just thought, oh, that's normal. Apparently it isn't because this one doesn't do that. So uh, I think it's worth the extra, I think it's what, $200? And that's the other thing like this canvas 22 plus costs 549 dollars and that's a very manageable like a budget to like save up during the year and then you like give you give yourself that present if you're already working i think this is a very good price and honestly like i've been using this non-stop a lot of people have been telling me my work is getting better and i put some of that on the fact that now I'm working on a big ass screen, I can actually see what I'm doing, I can like paint things because I've been painting a lot of my pieces, uh, things just like look better because the colors look better, I've been doing a lot of colorful work, work, colorful work and I, I have to give credit where credit is due, like the colors look great, the lamination makes it look very like that's where i'm doing the line so it's there like honestly it's worth the money in my opinion uh i think for someone that wants a better upgrade 22 inch is a very 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 decent size to work with uh it's a bit big i'm not gonna lie if you don't have a lot of space on your desk Please be mindful of that because I have a big ass desk and it's still big. <laughs> so that's something. And if you do TikTok or whatever, like Reels, you can record as you can see here, like you can record your screen and it looks great. Like it honestly looks great. Uh, I, I've been loving it. So if you wanna check it out, check the link on the description box below. And I will be posting a review on my website, uh, like with some other information and yeah. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below whatever you want, and subscribe. See you in the next video. Goodbye. Thank you, Huyan.